Hey everyone, how's it going? Justin Miller again here from Pips Ahoy. And today I'm actually very excited because I want to show you my scalping strategy on how I catch anywhere between 50 to 250 pips per day, just scalping gold. And you know, this is funny. You're going to have a lot of people sell expensive training courses for this. They're going to charge you an arm and leg to teach you some kind of, you know, magical strategy. Uh, <clears throat> right here, I just want to go ahead and show you a very simple way of how I scalp gold. When I show you this, you're going to laugh because of how simple it is. And a lot of you probably already know this. This is actually very basic information, but I just follow the basics and I use divergence with it. So if you don't know, if you don't know what divergence is, that's what my entire trading career is based around. It's just based on divergence. Basically to sum it up, it's like this divergence is when there is a difference between price action and whatever indicator you are using. In this case, I personally like to use the OBV, uh, which is on balance volume. I personally like to use the OBV indicator. So divergence goes like this. Let's say you're in an uptrend and you, you see divergence, then you place a sell. That's it. If you're in a downtrend and if you see divergence, you place a buy. That's it. So uptrend, divergence, sell, downtrend, divergence, buy. So let me give you a good example of divergence. Right now I'm on gold on the daily time frame, and we're currently in a channel. So here's divergence starting from up here. To down here, we are in a downtrend, but on the OBV indicator, from here to here, it's in an uptrend. So that's a clear difference. So in this case, because gold is in a downtrend starting from here to here, and because we see divergence, meaning the OBV indicator is doing the opposite of price action, we're going to get into buy positions. Now, now that we know what type of buy positions, we're now that we know what kind of trades we're going to get into, which are buy positions, let's scalp it. Let's go on to the one hour time frame, okay? So right here, I'm on the one hour time frame. Now this is what we're gonna utilize called wicks. Wicks are very beautiful for gold. If you don't know, gold respects support and resistance very well. It is one of the most well-respected commodities, forex pairs, whatever out there on the entire market. And uh, in this video, I already showed you, if I haven't already showed you right now, I'm actually gonna show you a video recording of what I did just today, just trading today alone gold. Uh, we're talking trades where most of those trades were on five mini lots. So I was catching anywhere between 40 to 50 pips per trade. While two of my trades I did on a standard lot and I caught about 30, 30 pips per trade. Uh, on a good day, I catch about 100 to 200 pips on a single trade. But on a slow day, I'll catch about 40 to 50 pips in the tr uh, per trade, which is what I did today per trade. So go ahead, you can add up the pips and that's how many pips I got for the day. Um, but I do this almost every single day, almost every single day I do this. So let me go ahead and get into the strategy. So first of all, I use this indicator, the OBV indicator, but I found a developer who actually took it a step further and they automatically plot these divergences, meaning reversals. So here's an example. Let's look at price action right here. Starting from here to here, this is a low, but a lower low. Okay, so low, lower low. Here on the indicator, on the on the OBV indicator, here's a low, but here's a higher low. So that's regular divergence, meaning when price were to come down and that indicator pops up with those lines, that's an in indication to buy, right? So I'm only using two confirmations. Number one, do I see one of these lines appear in the indicator? By the way, this yes, this is a paid indicator. It's not a free indicator. So one, do I see the lines appear? If I see a line appear, great, that's check number one. Number two, is there a wick to the left of where price is currently at? So let's say right now price is not right here. Let's say price is right here and we're currently waiting to see what will happen. I'm gonna look to the left and do I see an obvious wick, a decent sized wick? Yes, you have a wick right here and you have a wick right here. Okay, so that's two confirmations that this is a valid form of support. So. If you are in my free Telegram channel, which is below all of my Forex YouTube videos, I actually called out a buy right here on my free channel and people caught over 100 pips. I think people caught 200 pips. Let's count how many pips this was. I actually said a buy limit. So when I called out the buy limit, price was up here. So basically I was saying in the free in my free Telegram channel, when price hits this region, it's automatically going to activate your buy and it's going to shoot straight up. And it did exactly that. So let's count how many pips this buy trade spiked up by. Why is this disappearing? Sorry, give me a second. There we go. 
Gold spiked up exactly, exactly 200 pips from when I said to buy gold. And this right here is the, sim uh, the simplicity of the strategy. So number one, do you spot regular divergence? Not hidden divergence, uh, hidden divergence. I don't think I already covered it in this YouTube channel uh, for you know my strategy yet. So I'll probably make an entirely different video on hidden divergences. Hidden divergences help you confirm whatever trend you are in. Very simple. Uh, but a regular divergence helps you spot a reversal. In this case, we spotted a regular divergence means a reversal. So you have a low, lower low, low, higher low. Very simple. Once it came down, touched support, created this indicator line uh, that the paid indicator told me, hey, get into a buy position. Boom. That was my second indication that we are in for a valid buy. So as you can see, this is very simple. So let's also look over here. Uh, the reason why you don't see these indicator lines over here is because uh, the system only does it for current price action in this region, it doesn't go for previous data. But I guarantee you, if this was in the past right now, these lines would also appear saying that there was divergence. I just wanna go ahead and show you the simplicity of gold uh, when it comes to wicks and support and resistance. So right here, we have a big wick, a big wick. If you would have waited to buy gold right here at the bottom of this wick, look what look at what would have happened. You would have caught 120 pips if you would have held, right? Very awesome, very simple. And then if you look here at the indicator, it was telling you to sell right here, then eventually collapsed. But, uh, but anyways, there, there are times where it doesn't show all the divergences and all the hidden divergences. And uh, But at the end of the day, this is the simplicity of it. All you're going to be doing is looking for wicks. And then you want to see if you spot regular divergence at that wick. Very simple. And if you do, if those two confirmations line up, you get into a trade. So again, that is how I make about $1,000, 2000 a day trading, mainly gold because, you know, me, pirate, <laughs> um, I, you know, pirates like to get their gold and silver. So that's how I do it. Very simple. And yeah, it just takes practice. And it, this, this occurs in downtrends and uptrends. It, you just got to look for these wicks, wait to see divergence at that wick, and you place the trade. You can go for 50 to 100 pips just like that. Very simple. So that's it for this video. Also, let me show you more examples. Okay, let me show you more examples right here. We have a low, lower low on the OBV indicator, low, higher low, regular divergence, right? Once it hit, it spiked up by 80 pips. So if you literally work a full-time job, but you have access to your smartphone at your job, and let's say you have a $1,000 account, and let's say you are comfortable trading with one mini lot per trade, meaning a dollar per pip. And if you catch 80 pips, you just made 80 bucks while working at your job, right? So this is a great way for you to practice divergence trading while catching trends, you know, trading with the trend and uh, also practice by catching these wicks. So that's how I day trade gold and silver, but mainly gold. This is uh, my bread and butter. I I'm I wanting it to become my bread and butter. That's why I'm practicing it every day and I'm getting better and better. So that's it for this video. Enough rambling on. Take care and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.